Hello clever programmers and welcome to soft hints. In this video I want to share with you how to declare multiple variables in Python and how to do the right way and what should be avoided. I will share some common errors for beginners and finally I will demonstrate some techniques why we have problems with uh, multiple variable declaration in Python. Before to start I will share another picture from commit strip and guys having problem with naming their variable. They try data, data db, list completed, array list data completed. After hours of fighting it seems that finally they go busted. And my question for you is do you have problems naming your variables? Do you have problems with naming projects and stuff like this? Can you share some funny moments or some good examples and bad examples and why is not good I will expect your comments in the comment section below so let's go back on our topic first we will see simple declaration of multiple variables when we have different values and when we have a single value and let's see our example uh, here we can see how to declare multiple variables when we have different values. For example, here we have three, var three variables x, y and z or x, y and z depending on your language and we assign value none to all of them. Below you can see uh, 1, 2 and 3 again assigning to these variables and as you can know already python is uh, free and you can omit the type so the type is going to be infer automatically and python is strictly objects oriented which means that uh, everything is object in python so uh, this is created as an object uh, the same is for this one and we have assigned an object ID with each of these variables and we'll see later why this is important and how to use it um, here we are assigning one string and a list and here we have two boolean values and what is going to happen if I add one more value here Maybe you think that uh, we are going to initialize hex with true, y with true and we will just skip this. But you are wrong in this case because we have error. It seems that uh, there are too many values to unpack and we expect only two. And what is going to happen if we have the reverse case? We have only one value. Again we have uh, error this time it's saying that uh, the type of this value here it's not iterable and cannot be iterated over it in order to assign values to these two variables okay so these are the two errors that we have uh, how we can assign one and the same value for our variables we can do it in this way or we can add equal signs here and this is fine and it's working and if we want to see what values do we have about uh, sorry about x and y we can see that here we have true which is okay which is perfectly fine for us but let's see what objects do we have because this could be a problem uh, sorry I didn't put the ID here okay so it seems that we have one and the same object ID for both of them and is this a real problem let's check mm, for example let's do x minus 1 and let's print uh, sorry, I want to print the values, not the ID. Okay, so let's print the value. Uh, of course, this doesn't make sense. 
so I will make it like this and as you can see right now we have three but what is going to happen if I do this operation as you can see we have again three if we print x right now you can see that we have minus one so we don't have any problem right now here but let's check what is going to happen if we have another situation and I wanted to see where is this situation mm, yeah it's this one so let's see what is going to happen if we initialize declare and initialize three variables to a list and then append a variable or value to one of the lists and then again do the same thing for another list maybe you expect to have a y to be equal to x and 5 and x or x to be equal to s and 5 but let's check what's going to happen so it seems that we have three equal lists which means that uh, our variables are pointing to one and the same object in memory which means that every time when we are modifying one of the lists the other are going to have the same modification which is a real problem and the best way to check this is by using code like this getting the ideas of the all the variables and checking what is happening and as you can see on the first iteration we have one and the same object assigned to the three variables and on the next one we are assigning a different object so if we print the last uh, values after this modification we will have a different value for y but these are some of the problems that you need to take to have in mind and take care when you're dealing with multiple assignments and multiple declaration of python variables so let's go on how to declare them using tuple list and ranges you can assign non value to these three variables by using this syntax tuple non uh, asterisk and free you can do the same also with uh, true or any boolean value you can use a range for example 0 to 3 to assign values 0 1 and 2 to these variables and finally you can use a list like this and if we run the code everything is going to be okay but if you add one more element to this list you have an error the same as we saw it already the same is for the rest of the examples so you need to be really careful when you're dealing with these situations and finally I wanted to share one another error with you which was uh, a clear one and easy one but maybe it's difficult for beginners we uh, not have enough values to unpack so as you can see here we expect free but we got zero and the way to solve this is by adding elements here so the other error was int object was not iterable when we have uh, less values comparing to the variables and on the other hand if we have more values than variables we have too many values to unpack so these are the three common errors for multiple declaration and if you have any questions as always please do share them in the comment section below you can see the one of the latest videos from me on the screen you can see the subscribe button so if you like the videos please do subscribe thank you for watching and see you next time